Nuclear fusion, the process that powers the sun, holds the promise of providing unlimited, on-demand, and clean energy for humanity. Unlike nuclear fission, which involves splitting atoms and comes with certain risks, fusion presents no danger of runaway reactions like the Chernobyl disaster. Additionally, fusion's byproducts are relatively low and short-lived, making them easier to manage compared to fission waste. Currently, over 30 research groups worldwide are racing to commercialize fusion as the world seeks to move away from CO2-emitting fossil fuels that contribute to global warming. In this pursuit of fusion energy, a notable new player has emerged, Blue Laser Fusion, or BLF. Founded by Nobel Prize laureate Shuji Nakamura and backed by major Japanese investors, BLF aims to develop grid-ready nuclear fusion power and recently raised $25 million in funding. Their proprietary laser-based fusion technology seeks to utilize a safe, non-radioactive hydrogen boron fuel, a departure from the traditional deuterium used in many fusion experiments. Nuclear fusion is achieved by transforming a gas into a plasma at incredibly high temperatures using superconducting magnets. The process involves colliding hydrogen atoms, tapping into the energy they produce, thereby emulating the reactions that occur in the sun. What sets BLF apart is its unique approach to fusion. Instead of using deuterium, they're exploring the use of boron as a fuel for their fusion reactors. Boron is preferred for its potential to produce fewer harmful neutrons, making it a safer and more favorable option. The challenges of nuclear fusion lie in reaching ignition temperatures and sustaining the fusion reaction while generating more energy than consumed during the process. So far, scientists have pursued two main approaches, magnetic confinement using powerful magnets in tokamak reactors and firing lasers in rapid succession. BLF believes that their expertise in semiconductor technology, drawn from Nakamura's pioneering work on blue LEDs, can overcome these challenges. The company envisions constructing a commercial-ready reactor as early as 2030, with plans for a 1 gigawatt system in Japan or the U.S. They plan to build a small experimental reactor in Japan next year in 2024. Collaboration is key in the world of fusion research, and BLF is partnering with other Japanese companies like Toshiba Energy Systems and Solutions and Yuki Holdings in order to bolster their efforts. While there have been some successful demonstrations of lasers generating electricity from nuclear fusion, the long-term sustainability of such efforts remains a crucial factor in order to make fusion commercially viable. The industry, including BLF, faces the challenge of securing sufficient funding in order to bridge the investment gap that could hinder the development of these large-scale fusion projects. Despite these challenges, the pursuit of nuclear fusion remains an exciting and essential frontier in the quest for a clean, abundant, and sustainable energy source for our planet and beyond. So what do you think? Is the dream of star power on Earth finally close to becoming a reality? Let us know your thoughts in the comments below. If you enjoyed this video, please like and subscribe to our channel for more. We'll see you next time.